Hey everyone, Blau aka Cove here, and today we're going to be going over our long awaited, highly requested integration, Twinkly. We're happy to announce in Lumia Stream 5.5, Twinkly has arrived just in time for the holidays. So let's get these holiday setups ready and jump right in. So before we do anything, let's connect to our streaming platform. And now you'll be brought to your light screen. We're going to select Twinkly and press connect. It will automatically search for your lights and hopefully it'll find them. If it does not find them, then we'll just put our Twinkly IP address in here inside the manual search. Uh, but we're going to search one more time. And now all of my lights have been found. So I'm going to select each one and press next. Of course, you need to have all of your Twinkly lights set up on the Twinkly mobile app. If you don't, make sure you set those up before you connect them to Lumia Stream. After that, we're just going to skip devices and be brought straight to the Lumia Stream dashboard. And if I refresh, you'll already see my lights have changed to pink. And if I come to Control Center, you can also see right here. So if I do green, my lights will also turn to green, change the brightness down turn the light off and on. You'll also see that I can go over to my Twitch channel immediately and I can type blue and my lights will turn blue because these are preset commands. Now, if we want to set up our own commands, we'll head to commands and we'll press add command and we'll set up a new command like emerald. I'm going to name this emerald and I'll press apply. Refresh, head back over to my Twitch channel and put exclamation point emerald and my lights turn emerald. Perfect. Now we're going to take it one step up and have a reaction happening with our light. So it's not just one static color. So I'm going to head to studio reactions and set up a new reaction. I'm going to call this reaction twinkly RGB and I'm going to create three slots. I'm going to do a red slot, a green slot and a blue slot. So now if you see me test this out right now, it will go from red to green to blue and it'll just keep doing that. We can also automatically create a chat command by making sure this is checked and press done. So now we can go over to our Twitch channel and just put exclamation point twinkly RGB. And now the lights are going off. So simple. We can also easily add this as a Twitch point reward by going to commands, Twitch points, add command. And we're going to name this Twinkly RGB again. Uh, if this could be named anything, as long as the type is reaction and the value is Twinkly RGB. We're gonna set the duration for a little longer than four seconds and press apply. So automatically it will link to your Twitch channel. And if I go to my Twitch channel, it will show up under Twitch points. There it is, Twinkly RGB, I redeem it. And my lights go off on the reaction. You also may notice my lights are continuously changing the pink. If I go to default state, I can set it to whatever color I need it to. So maybe I want my light to be off or maybe a blue color by default. I can set it like that. And now my lights will always be returned to blue. But let's dig a little deeper. I know many of you all are going to ask, how do we trigger the effects and movies that are inside of my Twinkly app? Now, what you'll be using is a studio theme. So we'll go to studio and then themes and then add theme. Now, while you're on this page, it is a premium only feature. We're going to head to our Twinkly app and we're going to go to our devices tab. Our devices tab, make sure your device is selected and then go to gallery. Now, while you're in gallery, you'll see a playlist tab. If you have a generation two device, if you have a generation one device, we're not too sure if this is going to work because we don't have one on hand. If you go to your playlist and press edit, you'll be able to add your effects. I'm going to add rainbow. Now that rainbow is saved on my playlist, I will go to Twinkly and I'll press refresh list and I'll select the type as Twinkly scene and I should see my rainbow show up. So if I go to rainbow here and I name this Twinkly, I'll press test and it should switch my rainbow theme. Perfect. So now if I press done, I can also set this up as my default state. So instead of always reverting back to blue, I can have revert back to that new theme. So I'll select theme as my default state and press refresh. So now anytime it goes back to the default state after an alert or chat command, it will revert back to my rainbow theme. You can also use these themes in a chat command, alert, switch point, or even our Lumia stream Twitch extension and so much more. We implore you to go check out our other tutorials and make sure you like and comment and give us some ideas of how you'll use your Twinkly lights down in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe and have a luminous day.